uh, welcome to Back of the Landing Net. Uh, we're back down here at a familiar place, Wally's Lake in Osmington. Um, hold special memories for you, Chris. Yep, my first and only £20 fish, which is a bit disappointing really, because that was over a year ago, and I thought <laughs> they were coming in a bit of a train. Uh, you've had plenty of carp, mate, don't worry about that. But um, this little fella here, he came out yesterday, caught a stunning catch, you see later. You see that later. Yeah, and uh, Chris has been down to World Mill for a night session. You'll see a bit of that as well. So, well, let's get let's get on with today's uh, job and uh, catch a few carp out of it. Hope so. <laughs> Congo rats, mate. A bit of a pickle at the moment, mate, isn't ya? Yeah, just a bit. He's bent right round that little island and gone straight into the reeds. He's just round the edge there. He is well and truly snagged. Well, Joe, I don't think he was meant to be. No, I'm, unfortunately it's only me on the landing mat. <laughs> um, really gutted about that, because it's never nice when you've got a fish snagged up um, so badly. It's not very nice for the fish. And uh, yeah, really gutted about that. Right, it's been a little bit slow down here so far, and um, we're really having to work for it, are we, Chris? That's right, we haven't had one on the bank yet. We've had a couple of little tickles on the old alarms. Yeah. But nothing, well, you lost that one in the reeds. I did, I'm still gutted about that. But um, anyway, we went off fishing separately this week, just to, uh, well, I just had a bit of a fish, and um, I went to Top of Manor. Oh, lovely. Yeah, Watmill Lake on a Friday night, and this is what happened. All those fish um, came between 6 p.m. and midnight. Um, I had 15 in total, so um, I brought the rods in at midnight because I fancy the kip, and on that lake you just can't get any kip. So I uh, woke up in the morning, peeing down rain, so I just packed up, went home. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, pretty good though. Lovely stuff. Um, yeah, loads of carp there, cracking place to go. Um, nothing massive. No, I didn't pull out one of the Wob Mill fat boys, there's a few in there. Um, but anyway, probably better than what you've caught lately, to be honest. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. I uh, was fishing down on the lake next door yesterday, uh, Meadow Lake. Um, only caught a couple of carp. Let's take a look at them. Alright, lovely stuff. Um, end of my first fish. Uh, as you can see, I had to battle quite a bit of weed to get that. But uh, lovely looking common carp. First of the day. Early bird catches the worm, eh? Back of the landing net. Well, well, well. Unbelievable. Um, caught my first 20 a couple of weeks ago. 22 pounds, six ounces, this one. Put up a cracking fight, you went straight for the reeds. Um, unbelievable. <laughs> Happiest day in a long time. Back of the landing net. Oh, what a fish. Well, there you go. Uh, new PB for me. Also set a lake record. How's that, Chris? Eh? Yeah. Fair play. I'll see you later. He's not happy. He's not happy. Well, Chris is just setting up again. Uh, that very small clip you saw um, of him playing a carp into the reeds. Unfortunately, that's a. Uh, Another one lost today. Um, it's been a bit of a stinker for us so far, but we'll keep battling on, won't we? That's it. Right, 
Right, I've just snuck back to Jay's swim and it appears there's a homeless in there. You alright mate? Oh look, it's Jay! Do you uh, you misread the weather forecast today or something? Might have done. <laughs> Might have done. <laughs> He's got flip flops, shorts. <laughs> it's bloody freezing. Here you go then Chris, finally in. Thank God for that. We've toiled all day. Eventually I moved swims, chucked it in a little hole. I was lucky enough for this uh, lovely common to grab hold of it. He's, um, he's been a lot of hard work, but I love it. Back of the land in there. <laughs> <laughs> right, this is more like it. Just had my one out and Jay's rod screamed off. So we're getting a bit of reward for our hard work today, Jake. He's coming straight in, isn't he? He's swimming towards you. Yeah, I'm just trying to keep him out of there. Uh, shit! Oh. Oh. I'm going to show you what I'm fishing with today. Um, basically, I'm using a nice stick mix. Uh, the problem with stick mix is, to make it a stick you need really small ingredients. And I want to use the boilies, same boilies that I'm using, chocolate molten tiger, and some halibut pellet. Put all those into a little device we call a crusher. You probably know who it's made by, but I'm not going to say, it's just a crusher. Give it away on the front, I think. And, uh, Chris Evans. Hey, Chris Evans. Chris Evans. That's right. Get the old maracas out. Hey, uh, <laughs> Good old crunch. And basically, there's not a lot in there. That's basically what you're left with. Lovely. Yeah, it's perfect stick mixes. All right, and then all you do, pop it in your PVA mesh. Really give it a good crush down. It should already kind of hold its shape without you even tying it up. Fantastic. You, you want to keep it tight just to give it a bit of an explosion when it splits. Simply twist PVA. Nice overhand knot. Keep it nice and tight. There you go. Pucker with a boilie. Ah! <laughs> right, so you take your little stick mix, take your hook link, this is how you stick it on. Simply hook it into it, give it a twist, hook it into it again. There you go, pucker. Right, that brings another episode of Back of the Landing Net to an end. Um, despite just the one fish for Chris, we've had a pretty active day, really. Well, you have actually hooked into about six fish. I don't know how you haven't managed to get one on the bank. It's one of those days where everything seems to have gone, gone wrong, really. I just, um, just I'm gonna go fishing another day and start again. Um, but yeah, could have, could have been. We could have had double figures between us today. That's it. Well, I think you used up all your luck yesterday, mate, with that twenty-two pound six. <laughs> yeah, I'm happy with that. What a fish! Back of land, that record. It is, yeah, yeah, and uh, lake record, rec lake record for Meadow Lake there as well. Nice, isn't it? Nice, always nice to have. That's it. But um, Chris saved us from a total blank in today. Only just, just a, just saw a moving in a different swim. Chucked it over, got lucky. There we go. Okay, go. There are some. Look, that's. The good thing about this place, there are some cracking common carp, stunning carp. Definitely. 
well, next episode will be a doubles match against our mortal enemies. It will be. It will be. It'll be a night fishing session, um, 24 hour session. Um, can't say where at the moment, but it's, I'm well, well up for that already. Yeah, it's an unbelievable lake, action all the time, so it should be close. Yeah. Well, nothing else to say, Jay, apart from. Uh... Yeah, see you next time on uh, Back of the Landing Net. <laughs>